Hi, welcome to the fuel injector service video I have for you today. I'm Dan Charnus, the mechanic and host of these videos. This is the third video I have. Um, I have made one on rebuilding automatic transmissions, again for Mercedes. And I have made another one on rebuilding a uh, turbo diesel engine from Mercedes. Now, today, what I'm going to be talking about, I actually have a set of fuel injectors here that a guy wants me to actually increase the pressure in these uh, injectors, the popping pressure it's called. That's the pressure that these injectors actually will fire at or spray off at. I'm going to talk more about this and show you how this is done and how these injectors work, what's inside them. Now, these actually came out of a uh, 84 300, I, it's called a TD, it's a turbo diesel station wagon, which is an interesting car, it's a, it's a pretty cool car. It actually, believe it or not, um, the first one of these wagons came over to this country for uh, one of the Beatles, John Lennon. He was one of the first people to have it imported into the United States before Mercedes even brought the model over to the States back, I believe, in 1979. And uh, the reason why people like this car so much is because it had the turbo diesel engine in it. It had a lot more power than the standard, uh, the original five-cylinder diesel. And uh, it had a self-leveling system for the, for the back so you could load it up. A lot of utility in the vehicle and uh, it has a very comfortable ride. So um, yeah, a little bit of history there. But uh, anyway, back to the injectors before I get started on uh, any more of this junk. These things actually, they come apart. And it, this, is a, this is one of the myths, or a lot of people wonder what is, how these things work, what's inside them. And uh, I've heard a lot of talk on listservs, the internet, different people, clubs, Mercedes clubs. A lot of people really don't understand how these things function or work. And there's a lot of um, misconceptions about what needs to be done in order to, quote, rebuild one of these fuel injectors. Now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get more into it as we do it. I'll show you this stuff. But basically, I want to show you what this thing has. This is one of the injectors here. And you can see it's got a bolt pattern right here. This is what you use to take it out of the car.